Well, let's get right back to it. Last time we took down Diablo, Lord of the Abs. Got some stuff too. Uh, oh right, I have to crepify in my rotation now. Put it on thanks to Diablo. Looks like... Oh hey! Must have missed that last time. Well, alright, perfect amethyst. That's three perfect, so once again we get to attempt a reroll. Starting off with gambling tonight. Don't mind that at all. Let's see how we do. Ooh. Hmm. Well, I do already have a better Grand Charm of Greed, so I should probably hold off on that. I'm going to have to figure out something to do with this. I don't just want to turn it into Bosch and have him immediately killed. Hmm. Ah, well. I wonder, I wonder, what are we going to do with Medusa's Gaze? I think we'll just shove a bunch of stuff in here now. This can get sold. This can get kept for secret reasons. And, yeah, two rings. I'll be happy to put those away. I think one shale rune can get tossed and not the other. The idea, Lem is actually my best rune right, right now, yeah. F. Why am I holding on to F? I don't need that. I can always go back and get another F. It's very easy. Yeah, I'll sell one shale rune, but not the other. Uh, idea being that I might need one, and I want to turn these three into a doll. And doll can become hell, and hell can become, I think, Io. And that would clean up a lot of space and get me better stuff. It all requires gems, like the chip gems, so... Let's keep our eye out for that. I'm not going to be up to, like, the flawed emerald stage of that for a long time, though. Th that will do me. I'll just, I guess, keep another couple runes kicking around. I hate to get rid of any of them just because it's so rare to find them. And, you know, just as soon as you get rid of one, you'll recognize, hey, wait, I could have used that. Such a shame. Of course, we do want to go after Bale. Uh, we apparently can't get there yet. Praise be to the light. But, uh, Tyriel will help us out. Now what I want to do is go right there. Uh, yes. I. I want to dip into Act 5 for just a second here. It takes more. Yes, takes more than a siege to stop me, he says. Okay, so... Just wanted to take the free corpses. Turn on that quest. Um, probably summon Amy as well. Amy now costs a ton. She's one expensive lady. 100 and, 120. How many Daves could I have for that cost? 20 per. 6. I could have 6 Daves for that cost? Ugh. Amy, you are not better than six Daves. You're barely better than one. I don't even know. Um, how about the Stony Field this time? Oh, oh, wait, I know. Uh, Black Marsh instead. Yes, yeah, so we'll gather up a few corpses here. And while we're at it, just in case anything amounts to anything. She is right there. Would you go get her already? Yeah, gather up a few corpses here, and you know, just in case we happen upon the Countess's Tower, well then I'll know where it is for, for the future, as long as I don't leave this difficulty again. And now you can see Amy's aura activating a little more directly there, that's, that's kind of a nice thing, nice little touch. Oop. I was expecting there to be more monsters here. How many Daves? Only a, a mere 11. For shame. Uh, 
And Zohar is going to be pretty good too. I think though that I can bother going on in. This will be plenty enough of a force, I think. There we go, and the aura is on. That's, that's pretty good. So, off we go. To Haraga. Nact 5 and the awful guest monsters. How may I be of help? And what'll they be today? I think we saw some burning dead archers before. Which probably means that Amy isn't going to be all that great in this specific place. Although she can tank an unlimited number of their arrows, so that's... That's probably next door to goodness. It's, uh... Oof. See, I, now I have way too many different skills to pick through. I managed to make my life complex without really meaning to. Oh, and I gained a level. Well, level 77, it appears. Well, how goes the fighting, Dave? Zohar? Good? Oh, tell me that this trellis armor just up and has four sockets. Wouldn't that be something? Ah, well. Anyway. I have a minor plan forming, and it has to do with keeping my minion alive. Come now, Golzar, where are you? What have you gotten yourself into? Don't make me suddenly have to pay attention now. I'm considering my next skill. I'm also being harmed. <laughs> okay. Am I out of harm's way? <laughs> ah. Archer has delusions of grandeur. You will not take me out. Okay, now are we cool? Now can I stop and consider my skills? Hmm, a chipped gem. Man, that... that Noxious gas. It's so awful. Alright, let's take a look at things. One socket. Worthless. Shiver armor. Oh wait, trellised armor isn't the elite one. That's the uh, that's the exceptional one. Its defense is not high enough to be elite, I don't think. Okay. Yep. Yeah, well, that was incredibly sloppy and boring. <sighs> the potion button was right there, and I just didn't feel like touching it. Ah well. I am Qualkeg. Afternoon. Let's get the band back together. There was a lot more arrows than I expected. Uh there we go. Did we leave any corpses behind here? I rather hope we did. Miners, so I'm really gonna have to be on my toes, I guess. Can't even stop and think about my skills before. Nope, a bunch of arrows. Six. Really, I just need a little buffer. Eight should do. It'll be just fine. What did that cost me? 13 grand. Probably like about 50,000 gold, that death. Shame, really. That was not instructive at all. It was just dumb. Zoop. I mean, although, since I had nothing there and you get to see the little white pip now, you can tell that I actually... Uh, did get experience back. And frankly, I lost about as little experience as you possibly can because I had just gained a level in the in the same area. 
Well now, let's put everything back to right. That's more or less it. Let's see where these archers are that think that they're so tough. Oh. Well, who the heck are you? Bane Bang. Well, color me unimpressed, Bane Bang. You can be a, be one of my guys. Oh, great. Hide behind something for a second. Well, I gradually get poisoned. Ugh. What a mess this is. Already. Anyway. Yes. Our point of golem mastery is my other skills are more or less where they are where they need to be. This is rather ridiculous. This my I have maximum poison resistance and this happens to me. Well, I guess I shouldn't say maximum. There are actually things in the game that allow you to increase your cap, your resistance cap over the 75. There's a, an absolute cap at 95. Well, for for your player characters anyway. Monsters, of course, get to have resistances on up into 150 or so. Key thing being here that I have to keep everybody together and keep them blocking for me. And finally maybe get a sense of what skills I'm using and what order they happen in. Alrighty. Plague Shank the Sharp. I'm not impressed, Plague Shank. All right, no longer poisoned, full team, more or less. Let's see about getting that more full. That's that's a lot of poison. I don't need quite that much poison. What else we got? Okay, that's pretty good. Ah, see, this is part of the problem. They can hit me from a wide area and they tend to prefer me to Dave unless Dave is attacking them, so that can get kind of weird and problematic. Okay, which kind of Zohar is that? Ah, fire. Not great here, but good enough in general that I'll keep him. I think we can afford one more of you. Sure. I was never good at sh shuffling through skills. Could never remember what I had on what spot. Not enough mana. What? You're kidding me. 34. There. There, that's pretty good. Now, just let uh, David and company lead the charge here and we'll be fine. Burning Dead Archers are about the last thing that I want as a revive. They, they just won't move around enough. <laughs> we guard the stairs to the end. Well, guess what? Zohar is in full force tonight and is actually pulling his weight. Happy about that. I mean, the thing about this place being perfect for burning dead archers is that it is equally perfect, if not better, for my Zohars. Oh, good. 
Gulzar decided to also gain a level. Oh. See, I saw the... I saw the fire thing hit me, but I didn't see what poisoned me. That could be an elite in that case. If that's the case... I'm gonna suit up for it. Oh no, Amy. Alright, so how are we doing? Hope everyone's... Yep, it's not maim. Spectral hit, that's what poisoned me. I guess that makes sense. I was just trying to take it easy myself. Have a little coffee here. I was taking it so easy that I you know, lost, lost my nerve. No, oh, Amy is not having a good time tonight. Let's throw Goofy in instead. Shark tooth armor. That sounds pretty cool. Acquired strength 103, eh? Well, that is pretty cool, but not for me. Yeah, this is not where we want to be. want to be over here. Whoop. Perform a couple crucial optical dodges and watch the team go. No, they seem to be more attentive to things tonight. More active. Making better plans, like Dave in front, Zohar behind. It's all it's all coming together, really. Crew has never been more on point. Let's see if we can keep this up. I mean to take out the big B. The big bad. The big bail one arrow. <laughs> One tiny arrow can hurt so very much. Let that be a lesson to you. Your words are like an arrow. They're very small, but on fire. I do admit I occasionally have difficulty telling the difference between the enemy stuff and, and my skeleton stuff. That would be magnified even worse if I were reviving monsters. Okay, look at that. See? That's, okay. that's a reason to pull back for a second. And now, in we go. Good. It's locked. Mephisto, Lord of Locked Things. Probably locked that. No, well, the death that I gave up was entirely my own fault, and these are not the these are not even bad as far as guest monsters go. I could consider myself a little lucky in that sense. Who are you? You're a special dude. As soon as I'm sure you're not paying attention to me. Oh, Snot Skull. Well, that's cute. Multiple shots. He would be really dangerous. Man, oh man. I mean, would be if he were paying attention to me. See if we can get everybody safely up the, the the stairs. I guess they're stairs. Yeah, they're like little planks. Eh, 
man. Poor Dave taking the full flaming fusillade. Haha, <laughs> but I have a surprise for the fearsome, what, Octet? No, Nonet. Well, it's Noctet now. <laughs> There. Of that non. Oh, one of them dropped his arbalist. You know, at the moment I'm acting like I'm sightseeing this bloody place. I really should get on with it. I don't need to kill all these monsters. Barely need to kill any of them, really. <sighs> Ogre Axe, though. 28 to 146. We have a really good thing or oh, though. Yeah. It's unlikely that this is better than what he has, but, you know, on the outside chance. That's just sort of how it goes in Diablo, you know? Like not everything is an upgrade. It's a shame. Really, if money were just a little more useful and a little less everywhere, it would make a lot more sense. doing on poison. Not overdoing it, I hope, Zohar. Now, well, two is about the most I ever want. Let's see, since we have enough corpses around, let's see if we can't get a little better than that. Yeah. Good enough. Again, not doing anything to the burning dead archers around here, but there are plenty of other monsters. Oh, I see. The team has a hard time in this little crawl space. Seventy-five poison resistance. I... I swear. Oh, wait. They're not even immune to fire. I just presumed they were because they had burning in their name. It's the demon imps who are immune to fire. The burning dead are immune to poison. Yeah. How did I miss that? Just wasn't paying attention, I guess. Paying attention to everything else. You'll forgive me. There is a lot going on. I mean, from frame to frame, what is happening? Oh, hey! This monster was never alive. And yet. <laughs> it's like having a bit of a... It's like a small trophy, really. Having a monster that doesn't even appear on the battlefield on your team. He's another one of the corpses that's just sort of placed there to prove that the battlefield is dangerous. We saw a lot more than that in Diablo 3. Oh! That is a dude. It's Dak Fallon. Dak Farron? Dak Fallon sounds like a like a movie actor. Not not a uh, not a demon imp at all. Well, I will take your unraveler head. I will make that deal with you. All right, let's see if we can get the team safely up the stairs. This will be tricky. 
This will require all of my skill. <laughs> I wonder if we can do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm having, I'm having too much fun tonight. I am. I should calm down. <laughs> can we get up the stairs, he said. Yes, warrior. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mercy. Oh, hey, while well, we're here. I am a guest. That's just too precious. I'm like, ah, well, if there are no monsters past here, then, you know, maybe we'll... Wow, that is such a piece of junk. That's amazing. Well, pretty soon I'm going to exhaust this place of the available corpses. The straight up diamond is both too high to be useful for combining the runes that I have and too low to be useful for anything else. Kind of a uh, kind of a grumpus that way. I need mana. You do. As do I. Enough mana. Oop. There we go. Alrighty. Oh, of course, I didn't. Uh, I didn't drop a portal or anything, so we're gonna have to run all the way there. This is a real corpse run. It's more what it felt like back in the day. You're fresh. You're new. Feel a little undressed. I mean, quite. Literally undressed. Oh. And you discovered just how many monsters you've left behind. Charming. I really didn't think it was quite that many. Hmm. Come now, Dave. Let's see if we can be a little more intelligent about this. Oop. Speaking of... The game does not spawn new monsters. There are very few things that can actually generate monsters. You've seen all of them by now. And if one of those isn't around, then the game creates monsters only once. And so each of these is a monster that we somehow left behind or failed to kill. Simple enough. They're kind of isolated. It's not surprising to see a Demon Imper 2 do that. They tend to teleport away and then walk away and then get uninterested in you. And then the skeletons get disinterested in them. And just look at them go. Wearing the wig like the Founding Fathers. There he goes. Now then, I have stranded my corpse on the far side of a rather sticky situation. There are a bunch of archers there, and they mean to shoot me in the face. Since inevitably I will lead the crowd, because the, the road narrows as it were. This means I somehow have to cajole my minions into going up the ladder before I do. Or entreat the monsters to run away from where they are, or somehow hit the minions instead of me. 
It'll, uh, it'll be a trick. Seems to have worked out pretty well. Where's my corpse? It's very close by. Why, well, I should be able to see it from here. Um... Yeah, it should be right on top of it. Where the hell is my corpse? Oh, there it is. How'd it get there? I didn't go that far. I tell ya. Some days you can't just can't find a corpse. Okay, this time no excuses for not using a full rejuve. Although I did die very, very quickly that last time. Okay, again. So far, only one of you gets to be poisoned tonight. I've decided. 